All right, welcome back to another video. And as you can see, quick little two bo uh, two hanger boxes of 2022 Mosaic Football. Obviously, you know, Brock Purdy's a big chase. Uh, Kenny Pickett. Maybe if you actually believe in Desmond Ritter and Malik Willis still. <clears throat> but week one is almost done. Just got a Monday Night Football game tonight. I think Bill's in... Uh, Jets, I believe. So, figured might as well for the first Monday Night Football. Open two quick hanger packs. It's weird that they put... I know they've been trying to do this, going with the hanger pack, but it's weird to put it inside of a box when it's already in this, but... It is what it is. So far, my Eagles won yesterday. A little sloppy after going up 16-0, to but... You take the win any chance you can get. A lot better than the Giants last night, that's for sure. 40-0. to zero. <clears throat> Joe Montana. There's a Malik Willis debut. Hopefully, after Tannehill threw three picks, there's no reason to keep throwing him out there. You might as well just let the young guys, whether it's Malik, whether it's Levis, Matt Corral, who got cut by New England from what I heard. Missed like two practices or meetings or something like that. Not good. Brees Hall Silver, though. We'll take that. Uh, Lawrence Taylor Mosaic. And our orange reactives are coming. Nice little Anquan Bolden. Ty Law. Hopefully a good rookie here. Bucks. We'll take a Tom Brady, though. Just got his number to retired by New England yesterday at halftime during the Eagles game. Then a Brian Cook rookie. Jerry Rice. And then a touchdown Masters. I pulled this before. <clears throat> of <clears throat> Kyler Murray, who Cardinals actually played pretty close to, was it, yeah, the Washington Commanders. That was honestly a bit surprising how close that game was. But uh, the first hanger. Reese Hall. I don't think he's going to do a whole lot tonight. First game back after a torn ACL. I don't think he got any action at the preseason. But, yeah, some surprises yesterday. Some people are calling the Browns and Bengals game an upset. I picked the Browns to win. You can't. Ayuk went off, though. He was on one of my fantasy benches, unfortunately, and I'm going to lose that matchup. But, <laughs> speaking of another fantasy dud, zero points. Zero catches. It's like Hurts didn't even look his way. Josh Allen. You got Isaac Bruce. Drake London. Another dud. Zero catches for Drake London yesterday, too. So, some rough rough outings for some people last uh, yesterday. Sauce Gardner, rookie. Greg Dolchich. John Mechie. Then a Derek Stingley Jr. Silver. Aaron Jones had a pretty nice day. How did your team do? Whether it's football or even fantasy football. Uh, unless Garrett Wilson has a monster game today, I might be one and two in my leagues. One for sure is already wrapped up. Actually, two, I should say. But Garrett Wilson gets me 30 points. Then I'll pull out the W. We'll see. Adam Thielen. Chris Jones, who literally just got his little one-year, one-year, like, re, redone. So, all right, last orange. Jaquan Brisker, not what you're looking for. And then a bang of Derek Carr. So overall, quick little video. Nothing too crazy out of this. No no big quarterback pulls. No anything too crazy. I'd say the Breeze Hall is probably the nicest pull. But two orange rookies. And then silver Breeze Hall. Silver Derek Stingley Jr. But... Let me know how your team did. Let me know how your fantasy team's going, uh, who you got tonight, and what other things you expect from the upcoming season. You know, I know my Eagles play on Thursday night against the Vikings. Hopefully they do what they did last year. Game one, they were a little sloppy, and then game two against the Vikings on, I, I don't remember if it was a Thursday night as well, but dominated them. So hopefully we'll repeat that, but drop a like on the video. Make sure to sub to the channel, and I'll see you another time.